Andrew Garfield's Spider-Man has a perfect way of returning to the Marvel Cinematic Universe, but even though it would pay off a previous setup, the actor's possible Avengers, Secret Wars appearance could be heartbreaking. Garfield had to deal with criticism for several years, as the Amazing Spider-Man franchise is regarded as the worst compared to the other live-action Spider-Man movies. Still, Garfield was always a fine choice to play Peter Parker, delivering great dramatic and comedic moments in two films as Spider-Man. Despite The Amazing Spider-Man 3 having been cancelled, Garfield had another chance to show his Spider-Man was good. The actor was the highlight of Spider-Man, no way home for many, finally making up for Gwen Stacy's loss as Garfield's Spider-Man saved Zendaya's MJ from falling to her death. Since the 2021 movie, fans have been asking for the actor to play Spider-Man again, be it in the MCU, Sony Spider-Man universe, or The Amazing Spider-Man 3. Recently, Garfield commented about returning as Spider-Man, saying, I would 100% come back if it was the right thing. A new theory suggests how the actor could appear in one of the MCU's most anticipated movies, Avengers, Secret Wars. Avengers, Secret Wars theory has Andrew Garfield's Spider-Man fight Tom Holland's. The Avengers movie could pay off a Spider-Man, No Way Home line. Spider-Man, No Way Home brought all three live-action movie versions of Peter Parker together. The film showed how much chemistry Andrew Garfield, Tobey Maguire, and Tom Holland have on screen. With Spider-Man, no Way Home grossing nearly $2 billion worldwide, it is hard to believe that Marvel Studios and Sony would pass on the opportunity to have Maguire and Garfield return at least one more time before the MCU's multiverse saga is over. Tom Holland's Spider-Man 4, if it goes multiversal, could feature the duo. However, Avengers, Secret Wars is the most likely project for the multiverse Spider-Men. When Garfield's Peter Parker appears next, he could have to fight Holland's Spider-Man. That is what a new Avengers, Secret Wars theory suggests. According to the theory, Holland's Peter Parker could come into contact with the Venom symbiote. Spider-Man, No Way Home's ending left the MCU Spider-Man at rock bottom, making him susceptible to the symbiote's influence. After donning Spider-Man's iconic black suit, Holland's Marvel hero could give in to the violence he used against Green Goblin in Spider-Man, No Way Home's final fight, Turning to that darkness in order to defend his universe from destruction Marvel Comics Secret Wars saw multiple universes collide with one another. Some Marvel heroes destroyed other Earths to protect their own. This could play out in Avengers, Secret Wars, with Holland Spider-Man having to fight Garfield's Peter Parker to see who can save their own world. While the characters would likely choose to work together, the symbiote could cloud the judgment of the MCU's Peter. In the comics, Spider-Man gets the symbiote in Secret Wars. This heartbreaking fight would pay off Garfield's line of wanting to fight an alien, though it would be Holland's Peter with the symbiote. How Tom Holland's Spider-Man could get the black suit in the MCU. The MCU can connect to Sony's Venom movies. Tom Holland's Spider-Man and Tom Hardy's Venom have yet to meet. However, the SSU character did make a short trip to the MCU. Hardy's Eddie Brock got to know about Peter Parker being Spider-Man and received an MCU history lesson from a bartender before being sent back to his universe. However, a piece of the Venom symbiote stayed behind in the Marvel Studios universe. After the Venom, the Last Dance trailer showed Rex Strickland collecting a piece of the symbiote in what looked to be the MCU bar Venom was in, the film revealed that Strickland was in the SSU there were two separate pieces of Venom left behind, and the MCU's piece is still in the universe. Given how Holland's Peter Parker is in a darker headspace and the character got the symbiote for the first time in the comic Secret Wars event, Spider-Man getting his classic black suit in Avengers, Secret Wars seems likely. While Venom, the last dance ended with the symbiote sacrificing itself to kill the Xenophages, Venom could be back through the piece of the character that stayed in the MCU. This could lead to Tom Hardy's Eddie Brock also appearing in Avengers, Secret Wars. Avengers, Secret Wars could still give all Spider-Man variants a happy ending. The comics show how the conflict can be resolved. Andrew Garfield's Spider-Man returning to the MCU should be a reason for celebration, and having him fight Tom Holland's Spider-Man like the Avengers, Secret Wars theory suggests would be heartbreaking. Given the destructive nature of the incursions that will be part of the MCU movie, it would make sense if heroes from several non-MCU live-action Marvel movies fought heroes like Holland Spider-Man, the Avengers, and the soon-to-be-introduced Fantastic Four in order to save their respective universes. That could paint a bleak picture for the film. However, there is a way for all Marvel heroes to have a happy ending. 